Ah, good morning, everybody. Hope everybody's enjoying the outdoors. Although this heat makes it tough, but if you find a good place with some good water, you can enjoy it pretty good. I suggest going to Arkansas. They got some cold water running up there. Anyway, I'm gonna do a quick little video. I got my side by side out. And as y'all remember from my other video when I went up in Arkansas riding, I took a, a, a rock to the side of the tire up here. So you can see the tire plug over that way in the tire. Well, I'm gonna show you this little air compressor I got. It's really cheap. It's awesome to have. I keep it in my truck. I'm gonna buy a second one just to keep in the side by side. But I'm gonna show you this real quick. Let me turn it around. So this is the little air compressor that I bought. I think I paid like less than 40 bucks for this thing. And it comes with a bag and a bunch of little accessories and stuff for like airing up balls and stuff like that. So the really cool thing about this little air compressor is I have it plugged in. It's got a long cord. So let me turn the key on. All right, so I started the side by side up, and you can see the little light on the side right here. It's got a little light on it. Right there. It comes on when you turn the power onto it. But on top right here, you got this cool little gauge, little digital gauge. And you can come in here and sit to get a better view of it. There we go. You can come in here and sit where you want your tire pressure to cut off at. So if I want to cut off at 15 PSI, it'll cut off at 15 PSI. So it'll air this tire up. So if it's really hot outside, you can hop back in the car in the AC while this thing works. And I'm gonna turn it on and we'll let it go. And usually it'll go a little bit over the 15 PSI and that's when it'll kick itself off. And it might be just a tiny bit under, but it's pretty accurate on its gauge. should be if you actually put a gauge on it. Which I have a digital gauge, yeah, I'll go get it. All right, so I've got this gauge right here that I carry in my truck and it's pretty accurate. So we'll check that tire and see where it is. It beeped. Oh, hang on. You got it set on the other thing. There we go. PSI. And it's right on 13 PSI. Same as that other gauge. So there you have it. There's a, a cheap little cool air compressor that'll shut off automatically. It's got its own little gauge. It's pretty accurate. And, uh, I think it shuts off faster on the ATV tire because it builds pressure so fast and then it shuts down and then it cools off and then you see the temper that the pressure drop but so it's pretty accurate for the most part for a cheap little air compressor and like I said I carry one in my truck and I'm gonna buy another one to carry in a side by side for when we're riding for my little emergency box but uh, I'll put a link in the descriptions for this video for the Amazon list for you can find it and uh if you buy it, you know, if you click that link and buy it, I, I, I get a small commission. It just helps me keep keep my stuff going and keep making more videos. I'm not getting rich off of it by no means. But anyway, Bandit says it's hot and it's time to go for a ride. So we're going to go ahead and kill it now. So if you liked the video, find it helpful. Like, subscribe, share it. 
I got some other stuff coming up pretty soon that I'll be announcing. Pretty cool with it. Pretty excited about that. And, uh, well, if you like Bandit, just like and subscribe to the video. I'm Bandit. Where's he at? There he is. Bandit.